Handout 31 I had a question coming out of section 9.1 number 57 and here we were asked to find the first five terms of this recursive sequence and use the frac button on your calculator to help you. Now, I say recursive sequence, even though that's not officially in the words, because I want you to see we were given our starting point, which you always are if you've got a recursive sequence. And then you can see that our current term, a sub n, is defined in terms of a previous term, a sub n minus 1. And whenever that's the case, you do have something called a recursive sequence. And when they want you to find the first five terms of your sequence, I'll say you, you already have a sub 1 down here at 87 over 111. And yeah, it's an ugly number, but that's fine. We're just going to use our calculator. So if I wanted to find a sub 2, all right, so let's play this out. If, if I'm putting in n being 2, right, I'm going to put a 2 right there. And let's play this out. This would be 4 thirds times a sub 2 minus 1 plus this 12 over 37 number. So this would be 4 thirds times a sub 1 plus 12 over 37. But keep in mind, we knew a sub 1. We already knew a sub 1. Yes, it's ugly, but it I can still plug it in. So this becomes 4 thirds times 87 over 111 plus 12 over 37. And yeah, ugly number, not denying that, but you see me working that right here, right? So I put in my starting value of 87 over 111, and then I did 4 thirds times the previous number plus 12 over 37. I got this decimal, and I used that frac button to get me my second value, and that was 152 over 111. Okay, great. Now I'm going to play this out again. But instead of a sub 2, I'm going to do a sub 3, right? So now if I color code this, right, we go back to a sub 3, I'm going to plug the 3 in. Well, if n is 3, I'm going to put it in right there. Okay, and that's what the, what the recursive formula says. It says 4 thirds time a, times a sub 3 minus 1 plus 12 over 37. And when I simplify that, that is 4 thirds times a sub 2 plus 12 over 37. And we just found a sub 2, right? We found it to be 152 over 111. So I'm going to do 4 thirds times 152 over 111 plus 12 over 37. And that's what you see me doing right here. So let me let me show you. I'm, I'm, I'm in this answer part right here. Now this says take the last answer, and the last answer happened to be 152 over 111, right? I'm using what I had previously gotten. I'm recursively doing this. And then when I convert that to a fraction, sure, it's ugly, but I can still get it. So this is now a sub 3. And then I keep repeating that process, right? If I want to take a if I want to find a sub 4, all right? If I want to find a sub 4, take 4 thirds times what you previously got, which was 716 over 30, 333 and add 12 37 to it. And there's my next term. Right? If I want to find a sub 5, take 4 thirds what you previously got. Well, I'm going to put in the 3188 over 999, add 12 over 37 to it. There we go. Turn it into a fraction. And there is my solution. All right. Thanks so much, everyone. Bye.